Merry Christmas. Merry Latemus Christmas thingy. Merry holidays after the apocalypse, end of the year, whenever we're going to post this. Yes. <laughs> so, um, it's, it's been a while, and uh, I guess we're back? We are back. Yay! Thank God. Yay! I blame college. I blame... I don't know who, everyone, everything. I blame the end of the world. It killed this video. So hey, I don't know how, but it did. <laughs> the old wayfarer just gave us a cabin. Yay! I'm not sure how that fits in the letter, but yeah, it's a thing. It's like a pokeball. You touch it, and it gets bigger. Oh, that is. <laughs> Never mind. I won't go there. <laughs> Good idea. Um, <laughs> so um. So hey, can you guess what we're gonna do next? I'm thinking. Take your time. I don't know, it's been forever since uh, we commentated on the last video. Mm -hmm. What, October? No, it's uh, November. November, I think. Oh. Hey, I remember her. So do I. And I'm not even gonna bother to resist because if I if I want to get away from her I will just uh, teleport <laughs> hop skip and a jump and weird noises ah you've seen the Jolene fight yep does she drop her sword again mm-hmm oh wow I actually didn't fast forward this one huh Oh, it's all right. Well, there's some spoilers for a, a future video that, then. I uh, fast forward one of them. That's a good idea. There's no real point in trying to attack her if, uh, yeah. There you go. But hey, it only took two hits because I'm using the uh, power sword no, thing. No, the sword. Yep. Miss your sword. Don't forget your sword, miss. What are you doing? No. Come back! Your sword! <laughs> Why doesn't Link pick up the sword? Because this isn't Wind Waker. He can have two swords at once. Also, hey, the rod went up from, well, in the beginning, one rupee to 100 rupees. That's nice. Nice. Line bank ain't so cheap after all. Totally. <laughs> yeah, right. So, uh, jump cut. And there's another letter. Dancing letterbox. Anyway, yeah, the next thing we're doing is, um, well, advancing the plot. I have a question. Yeah? <laughs> the mailbox, what do they serve if there's this postman flying around? I, I guess they are for actually posting your mail? I guess. I'm not really sure either. Couldn't you just go to the post office? I don't know. Well, there's not a post office on every island. If there's somebody who's actually flying around the world, delivering mail, mailboxes are pretty much obsolete. <laughs> yeah. Or, you know, he could just put the mail in the mailbox. Yep. Oh, hey, it's one of these guys. But hey, how, how would you... Deliver meal to Link, then. They're boats. <laughs> yeah, just put a meal box on the boat. Anyways, these guys are pretty uh, familiar. Mm -hmm. I don't know, there's something wrong. Probably the eyebrows? Maybe. Nose? <laughs> <laughs> Tattoos? I don't know. No, not the tattoo. That's fine. Maybe his hands. The, look his the hands. arms of that look detachable. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> they really do. Good thinking. <laughs> yeah, they do, actually. Yeah. Hmm. Is he like a Lego? <laughs> uh, I can only move my arms in one direction. Help. <laughs> You mean in an angle? Yeah. 
Like, you can't move, uh... So, hey, I don't know what to say. Three oros, you know what that means, right? Or medals, I guess. Medals? Oh. Medals. Yeah. Medals. Metals. <laughs> I don't know. Um... Well, you got steel, you got... S you got iron, you got... What a what else? I don't know, gold? Uh, you got tin. Is that a metal? Basically, what's he, what he's saying here is, um, hey, go do three more dungeons. Remember that in Wind Waker? Uh, we got the pearls, and then, whoops, you gotta do more dungeons, all of a sudden. <laughs> yep. And, well, every other Zelda game, pretty much. Well, technically not Majora's Mask. Well, yeah. So hey, we have to remember this interesting we found the design. Triforce. End of the game. Yep. We have to draw it on that um, one door we can we can actually draw on in um, everyone's favorite temple. My God, that guy is really fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it should be saucy. I like sauce. Oh yeah, that's right, the cosplay sisters. Mm -hmm. So many things to remember. I know, right? Blah, blah, blah. Wait, was that a typo just then? Constume, did it uh, say that? I... I don't know. Huh. Oh. You went too fast! Oh, well. I'm too slow at reading. Well, I just remember to uh, watch that back. Uh, it's timestamp. Right. That's uh, noted. Thanks for sending it to me on <laughs> It's the best way to keep notes. It just pops in. I'm all like, whoa, there's a message on Steam, <laughs> better read it. <laughs> uh. What, Legend of Zelda? Ah, screw that, there's Steam. Speaking of Steam, those sales, oh my god. Oh yeah. I bought, what, three games and I only had $75. The rest I just gifted it to people. Aww. Like $50 worth. I give too much. How nice of you. I totally didn't sw swap out chip bots there. <laughs> Probably so. Chief of the Frogs, uh... Yeah, that was ages ago. Um, Chief of the Frogs. What does this remind me of? Another Wind Waker thing. Oh boy. All oh, right, the two uh, Frog Brothers on clouds. Oh yeah. <laughs> I just call them Frog One and Frog Two. I never really named them. Well, they have a name. It's just that you know I don't care. And well, that's uh, another earthquake on this island. That's, uh... So are we going to the Earth Temple? <laughs> no. The Earthquake Temple? Yes. Ah, oh, nice. Yeah, everyone's favorite temple. Yay. Oh. Yay? <laughs> uh, I don't know, it's, it's kind of... Uh... It's been a while since I edited this, but I think I fast forward most of it. Oh, actually, there's a new gimmick. Oh, they're red now. Yep. Red means better. Hold your breath. No, Link. These guys no. might pack a punch. Link, what are you doing? Why are you leaving the safe zone? Wow. Oh. He doesn't care about if, time. If I spend 60 minutes uh, talking to these guys, I'll, I might die. Slowly. Wow. If you notice, the time's not going now. <sighs> Got scenes. So obviously... Cutscenes make time stop, and since the time has stopped, the time cannot go down. Yeah, oh, there's a fast forwarding. Um, this sounds kind of silly. That's alright. Given the speed of fast, that's alright. <laughs> well, I, I, Everyone knows what I to do. I could always just cut it out, but I thought I might as well show you... Um, what the quickest way is to go through this place. 
And there's a reason why I'm not cutting it out straight away, because... As in another reason, because, uh... Uh, you'll see. Did you just hit that... Um, that phantom? Is that what his name is? I forgot. Mm -hmm. You hit that phantom, you got a key from him? He always has a key. Oh. And since... You see, I don't remember everything. <laughs> Lucky. Um... Oh. <laughs> Oh. But since we got the bow, we can uh, get this power gem. So, yay! That's a dick move from the game, just letting you sit on fire like that. Well, that's because I just got spotted, because I suck at this game. And that phantom? Yeah. Oh, come on. So, yep. Okay, you found the Triforce, end of the game. But I found it before already. Ah. I guess. Ah. So many red herrings. <laughs> yep. Well, oh, back to fast forwarding. I think that's actually a new thing now, uh, hitting the phantoms in the back. Well, that, that or I just never really tried to do that. But yeah, you can hit them in the back to stun them. Well, you do know that this is a sneaking game. Totally. So why would you hit them? Just go behind them. Well, it's not like I um, kill everyone in other sneaking games. <clears throat> I haven't seen your Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker LP. I'm sorry. Uh, don't talk about it. It's crap. <laughs> I have to. No. Everyone made mistakes. No. <laughs> so um, this is the room. The room that I remember the puzzle. Yeah. Um, except this time, instead of drawing an hourglass, we um, have to draw a Triforce. In a single stroke, even. How are you going to do that with a squarish pattern? Uh, it's pretty simple. Also, another treasure we can get now we have the bow and arrow for another gem. Oh, treasure map, never mind. It's a gem. Obviously. Yeah, obviously. Uh. Even the arrow points to it. <laughs> yeah, you can tell it's been a while. <laughs> oh well. We just forgot about everything. Everything. What game is this? Gotta redo... <laughs> gotta redo the LP. I mean... Oh, you have to... Yeah. I mean, this is Bioshock, right? No? Bioshock. Wait, are you foreshadowing the next LP? No, I'm not doing Bi Bioshock because other people have already done that. A thousand times? Nah. Well, it's not like that would stop me, but yeah, not really interested in doing that. <laughs> so there we go, we just spoiled you the next LP. Not Bioshock. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I do already have a couple planned in advance, but yeah. I might have one myself if I don't get lazy. Oh no, but hey, this is um, nice. Oh, this is ominous. Sounds like... a boss fight. Nah. Basically what this means is that we never have to run through the first part of the temple ever again. Oh well, that's even better. We spend like four minutes or so going down here, and every time we go down here using the shortcuts, that that's um, how much time we have left. Then, so you can try and improve it, or you just uh, go screwed. And yeah, thank God that YouTube limit doesn't exist. Which is why um, I didn't really cut it out because well, you never have to see it again anyway. Just remember the good old times. <laughs> oh, they're still there. The good old times in this temple. Oh boy. Did you hear something? Totally not. So, uh, that's the gimmick of this floor. Every time you actually Bing. run, you make a noise. Like so. It even shows up on the map on the top screen. So, uh, you're more... It's easier to, for you to get uh, caught, is that mm -hmm. it? Well, it's not really... Oh. Yeah. Mm. 
So you have to walk or else they hear you. Oh, you didn't have to walk, but it helps. <laughs> yeah, I mean, when they're near... Oh. Hello. He just doesn't care. Yeah, I don't really um, care all too much about the phantoms. I mean, they can do some nasty crap, but if you can just do that, then yeah. I just... I just want this to become a hotel now, and the phantoms are like waiters and all that. <laughs> Every time you walk on that kind of floor, they could, and they just come in and go, "Yes, <laughs> what do you want, sir?" I'm not, My blankets are dirty. I'm not sure um, if if I would like to have a butler that uh, or waiter that um, also look at the map, the guy in the middle. Hmm. That's interesting. Um, but <laughs> he was walking on air. Anyway, as I was saying, I don't think I would like to have wages that try to kill me. Ah, I see. So, hey, markings. You can just walk over it. Sounds good. Yeah, I thought the best way to show that was to shift the screen like that because, hey, attention. Oh, that's a good trapdoor. Yep. Kind of sucks how it uh, triggers that early. Oh no! Oh. <laughs> well then. Uh, that's uh, normal, right? Uh, I guess. Hmm. Gee, that color switch was kind of a. Uh... What's annoying is that that guy on the right could actually tell where um, I am. But that turned out for the best, so yay. Ready for that? What are you trying to accomplish here? Uh, I'm trying to remember what to do. Think fast. Uh, I'm not really sure what took so long because. Yeah, I already know what's uh, what I have to do, but hmm. apparently I didn't in the past. Just gotta remember. Next part, guys! <laughs> <laughs> but the gimmick of this part is that uh, while you have the uh, sound floors, or whatever you would call them, and you have these two floors that are connected to each other. Oh, I see now. Oh. Just waiting for the other guy? Yep. So you gotta time this. And hit that guy in the back. Yeah. Well, this is as much as timing goes, but yeah. <laughs> Take aim from at phantoms from behind. Hmm. Sounds kinky. I wouldn't go there. Again. <laughs> You didn't see that. Actually, you did. That's uh, that's uh, what the pause screen looks like. Yay! <laughs> now you know. <laughs> so you found the round crystal. Yeah. Uh, it doesn't look round to me. It's pointy parts. The best thing about holding an item like this is that you can't really make any noise ever when you do this. I mean, you move slower, oh, nice. but it's easier to control because you don't have to. Uh, well, put the stylus, clo uh, stylus closer to Link to walk. You can just go uh, like normal. All these messages reminds me of Dark Souls, which I bought today. Yay, and then it didn't run. <laughs> I have a crappy computer. Oh no! Oh, that. Uh, whoops. <laughs> well. And now he's actually holding the gem. Or, not really holding, but he was guarding it. Well, like taking a break. <laughs> didn't really do anything. So, uh, let's take that gem to the pedestal. What will happen? Oh no! Uh, I actually expected that to, well, hit them, but it didn't. Oh! Oh no! Um. <laughs> Come on, you can do it, Link. 
This is totally as planned. Just my imagination. I like how just every guard is here, or a phantom. Well, you got them. You can now. You can go now. Mm -hmm. They're um, out of the way now, so yay. Wait, I remember there was a triangle hole, I think. Mm -hmm. You're gonna have to get one of those uh, triangle crystals, don't you? Yep. There's also oh boy. another one, and you'll see it in uh, well right now. If you look at the minimap, that is. I'm looking at it. Oh, there it is. It, there is a square, a square one as well. And there's a guard guarding the gem mm -hmm. on the other floor. I just saw that. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, hello, whack, and then, yep. These guys are really inefficient. Yeah, they don't really hear you at all. So you can just run behind them, and there's no issue. They're like bat. They're the opposite of bats, actually. The opposite of what? The opposite of bats. They can see, but, you oh, know... Oh, like that, right. When they try to hear you, they actually don't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you need ultrasound floors. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how that works. Neither do I. Oh no, we got caught, but more importantly, we got a gem. Yay! It's funny that this is the Courage Gem when you're walking on an invisible floor. Mm -hmm. It's a precious time here. But the penalty for getting hit isn't uh, really that bad. I mean, you get plenty of time, so who cares? Plus, we've got that shortcut right there now. Nice. Yay, and that brings us to another sort of gimmick of this place. Sounds fun. So, can't wait. This floor is also connected to the others. Well, actually, it's the same as the one we just went to. There's uh, three floors here that are connected like that. Hmm. Something else around here. Oh no, what might it be? Oh, what the? It's a Grim Reaper. Yeah, those are whiz robes. Uh, their gimmick is they start chasing you when you're not facing them, and when they hit you, they subtract 15 seconds from your, from your timer. But when you kill them, you get 30 seconds back. So, yeah, once you know how to beat them, it's actually a nice bonus. I think it's too much of a bonus. But... Oh well. Well, you know, Nintendo giving you as much lives as possible. But I totally need those 1 million 1-ups that I have in New Super Mario Brothers. Uh, yeah. They actually even capitalized collecting things in New Super Mario Brothers 2. Uh, I didn't really like that one myself, but... It's just coins, coins, and coins. It's like proper economy. Or something. Capitalism, that's what they're teaching you. Capitalism, ho. Ho! <laughs> so, that switch right there actually uh, makes a trapdoor uh, open up, but it's kind of hard to get this particular one because the phantom here doesn't really cooperate ever. Like, you would think you would go to the right and then it's all good, but nope. Well, now you can go. Oh, never mind. to kill him. Or, we'll drop him down anyway. It just doesn't care. Mm -hmm. Oh. You actually get a reward for killing all of them. Oh, there are a certain number. Oh, well, I guess that's reasonable. Oh, you could see them on the minimap. Um, 
they were marked by little skulls. Oh. So that explains everything. I kind of forgot to point that out. But, oh well. Oh, that's fine. As long as you actually explain it. At some point. Um, what I actually think is kind of weird. When you stand on a safe place, um, everything becomes transparent except for your shield and your eyes. So I'm wondering, what do the phantoms see? When you're standing in the safe zones. They probably see... Uh... Kind of like Harry Potter with his invisible cape. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's actually only the ones you create, like the one down there. I think my theory about the invisible cape is better. That's just me. So, uh, what we have to do here is bring all of the um, gems back to that one floor. And I didn't mean to do that, yay. Oh, since you have, um... Yeah, since I have the shortcut, I can just go there. I don't know what to call it. The the thing that makes you go up. <laughs> that works. Yeah. So what I usually do is just dump the thing down there, and then get the other one. Seems complicated for nothing, actually, all of this. Mm -hmm. I mean, this entire video is based on, around this whole puzzle. Yeah, this is actually my least favorite uh, bit in the dungeon. What about the game? The what? The game. Is this the worst part of the game? Mm. It's not. It's not bad, but it's. Mm. it's Please don't say. Please don't say you hate the um. What should we call it? The treasure hunting mm. puzzles. No, what I think is bad in this one is that you have to do this um, all over again the next time you get down or you go down here. Oh, you better skip that part. I will. Thank God. But it's just annoying. That's actually something the next game improves upon. As in Sounds Spirit fun. Tracks, you have a similar temple, but you don't um, have to redo the previous segments. Which is you get the, really uh, nice. You get the shortcuts immediately after you finish yep. it. You can just go to the next floor. Also, if you set them down in that order, then you... Well, something different happens, but screw that for now. Wait, how do you do that? Well, he uh, just has the order of uh, saves right there. So, yeah, I think it was square, single, circle, triangle. So if you put them down in that yeah. order, then something different happens. That's kind of weird. Yeah, that's actually how we progress in this place, but not now. Oh, they were nice enough to give us uh, an exit. Well, we made some uh, progress. You. You. They were not prepared. So that guy gives us hints for money, but it's kind of a rip-off, so screw him. Is he Tingle? Mm, I would hope so. As in, with, with him would... being a skeleton and all that. I mean, well, Link probably murdered him <laughs> after the last game. Uh, Link, yeah. I have to pay this much? I know, right? Oh, hey, here's the real Tingle. So, yeah, that's the thing I missed from. Uh, when I cleared the last bit, which would be the ghost ship. So, yay! Huh. Also that one. How are you gonna reach that? Oh. <laughs> I didn't notice that! Yeah, most people don't. Excuse me. <laughs> Alright. 
and that marks our 10th uh, wisdom gem. You get your wisdom teeth removed. Oh no. I don't know. It, wisdom teeth removal wasn't that painful for me. And I got all four of mine removed at the same time. I just have a good dentist, I guess. Yep. Just all that anesthetics. <laughs> You'll be so drugs and all that. Yay. That's a nice ship. Yep. I made it red. You support the devil. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching and see you next time. Happy Hanukkah.